What is up, YouTube? It's the Mint 334, and I'm back here with another Pokemon Booster Pack video. Today, I got here some more one of those classic packs from Walmart. If you guys remember from my last Friday hunting booster pack hunting video, I found a few of these. And today, I actually stopped by two different Walmarts a bit far from my workplace. Uh, definitely, Walmarts I'll check out again for adventure Friday live hunting adventure videos. The reason I checked them out because I was just curious to see what they were like. And yeah, picked up these four one classic pack they, they call them the assorted legacy packs apparently and yeah decided to pick up four uh, I found two more primal clashes but I also found two roaring skies and decided let's open them up again and see what we can get redeem myself I thought these are pretty cool when I opened them last time so let's give them a shot again shall we Let me go ahead open this up these were again 596 a piece which is not too bad um, not the greatest, but still not too bad actually. So that's pretty cool. But yeah. I actually also found some interesting uh, one pack blisters of Steam Siege, the same ones like I found for Ancient Origins. But I didn't pick them up because at the time I was like, I kind of save up a bit and wait till I get paid next time. Then I'll come back and open them, pick them up if they're still there. That is, when the time comes. But for now, just these four would do great. I also picked up one more at another Walmart on that same day. I'll show you guys what that is later. It's pretty cool. It was pretty, to me, I consider it vintage. Actually, I consider any of these vintage. Not too old, I guess, but they were released like about two, three years ago. So somewhat getting harder to find them anyway in their old blister forms or classic packs, which I thought was cool. I like variations like that at Walmart. That's why I picked them up. But yeah, here's our four booster packs. Let's start from oldest to newest, which is Primal Clash. So yeah, starting off with... Art of what pack? Picking this up. Code card for you guys right there. Oops, knock the camera again. One, two, three, one, two. This pack starts off with Nose Pass, Volbeat, Spinda, Mudkip, Phoebus. Crowvile, Shield Energy, Kakuna, Star U Reverse, and a regular Breloom Rare. So, nothing good from that pack, but that's fine. Moving on to the next Primal Clash booster pack with Groudon on top. Foot code card. One, two, three, one, two. Alright, this pack starts off with Zigzagoon, Trico, Vulpix, Rhyhorn, Volbeat, Rough Seas, great card back in the day for water decks, Bufalant, Energy Retrieval, Trampitch Reverse, and ooh, a Holofoil Hilpaldon. So pretty good, we scored one thing right off the bat, very nice. Pretty cool hit. And now we move on to our Roaring Skies. Let's start off with, let's start off with Deoxys. I like Mega Latios more, so let's start off with Deoxys. Code card. One, two, three, one, two. All right. This pack starts off with Swap Blue. Shup it. Fletchling, Togepi, Execute, Goodbye Score, Tranku, Altaria, Bagon Reverse, and a Beauty Fly Hollow Foil. Nice! So two Hollow Foils. Awesome! So two hits. Pretty cool. Pretty, pretty cool. So last pack of Roaring Skies would make a Latios on it. I would really like to pull any of the Rayquaza cards. There are four different, two different Rayquaza cards and EX cards in this set, along with two different Mega EX Rayquazas, because at this time they were introducing Dragon type energies instead of normal type. So, sorry, let me correct that. They were trying to introduce the whole new Dragon type as its own, because Dragon type Pokemon used to be under normal energies along with Flying type. So, yeah. This is why there's two different Rayquazas. Voltorb, and also I think it's because Rayquaza is a mixed type. It is both 
a flying and dragon type so flying type pokemon are still considered normal in this set so i guess that's why they did two different kinds so there's voltorb togepi shuppet spiro wingo silcoon healing scarf Lyscore, binnacle reverse and a rashiram hollow foil that's pretty nice Alrighty guys, so actually pretty awesome pulls, not gonna lie, these are some pretty nice pulls. So overall, we pulled three different holo foils, no EXs, but that's fine. Honestly, I'll be happy with these three holo foil pulls anyway. So we picked up a Reshiram holo foil, a Beautyfly holo foil, and a Hupaldon holo foil. So yeah guys, if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, subscribe, comment down below, and stay tuned for the next Pokemon Booster Pack video. Peace guys!